your DevOps interview, you are asked what feature of Kubernetes would you use to keep your environment specific settings separate? Let's take a real world scenario. Your production deployment is scheduled for tomorrow and suddenly the application team informs you that the application URL has changed. Now the real question is, are you going to rebuild the image triggering your CI again? No, that's not how we do it in Kubernetes because that's slow and inefficient. The feature that we use here is called config map. Let's understand the different file method. We keep two separate config map YAML files, one for test environment, config map test YAML, and the other one for production environment, config map prod YAML. Each file contains environment specific settings like app URL, DB host, app mode, log level. So we don't need to build our image again every time some config gets changed. So while deploying into production, first apply the config map prod YAML and then apply the deployment YAML. This ensures that the correct production settings are passed to the application via environment variables.